Welcome back for another episode of Dyson Sphere Program. An update, I have been busy in between episodes. Oh my gosh. Um, when previous episode went out to, oh, where is it? Where's the Gamma Nome system? I tapped into the Kimberlite ore, the fractal silicon, and the optical grading crystals. I have them all coming in here. Well, no, 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 sorry, except for the fractal silicon, because the fractal silicon, whoop, how about this one? Boom, right there, this guy, taking it straight into making the crystal silicon, and then it is being flown in to uh, uh, or, 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 uh, Alula Borealis 3, where we're at right now. Now I also, oh my gosh, where do we go? Um, oh, the grading optical crystals, boom. Right here, change the recipe in the machines for the photon combiners. So now it's circuit boards and optical grading crystals. The kimberlite ore, boom, right here. Kimberlite ore being straight into diamonds and then diamonds going straight into the structure matrix and the graviton lenses. So got all that situated. Now also, oh my gosh, oh, where is it? I gotta bring up the spreadsheet. Okay, on Gamma Norme 1, there's 900 crystal silicons being made per minute. Then on Gamma Norme 3, I set up um, three smelting arrays to put out 5,400 high purity silicon per minute. That should last us a while, but it is now time to start working towards getting the Dyson Sphere done or started, I should say. And I've been poking around here in all this tech. Um, right here, this guy, the small carrier rocket. Well, here, let me start here. Boom, Dyson Sphere component. Use a small carrier rocket to transport to the, to the planned Dyson Sphere to form the nodes and frames of the Dyson Sphere. Okay, this is the small carrier rocket the delivery vehicle of Dyson Sphere components. If you want to speed up the construction, you need to send more rockets. Okay, well, to make rockets, we need Dyson Sphere components. Well, uh, we've got everything going here right now that we need to make Dyson Sphere components, but I want to get the small carrier rockets going. So we need, uh, ooh, game save, okay. Dyson Sphere component, Deuteron fuel rods, which we are making, and quantum chips, which we are not. Quantum chips. Take processors. Check, we're making those. And plain filters. Well, plain filters take Casimir crystals, which we are not making. And titanium glass. Ditto. We're not making that either. So, that finally takes us down to Casimir crystals. Which, we're going to use this alternate recipe right here using the optical grading crystals, graphene, and hydrogen. Finally being able to tap in and start using up that hydrogen. Now the cool thing about this one is, um, this graphene, I'm using the alternate recipe here with the fire ice which produces hydrogen and the graphene. So we'll be able to use up some of that hydrogen in this recipe. So that's what we're gonna set up today. Casimir crystals and titanium glass and just start going through things. We're going to see how uh, this episode goes, but it's going to be the, woo! Oh, 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 and the other thing. I set up four interstellar stations here. Boom. Tesla towers, satellite substation, wind turbines, solar panels, all ready to go. This guy, Mark III belts, Mark III inserters, miners and smelters then in this one planetary logistics stations interstellar logit logistics stations the orbital collectors assembly machine mark twos oh and speaking of which the assembly mark the assembly machine mark threes will finally be able to make those as soon as quantum chips are going so it's a it's a double duty right there that's why i want to get the quantum chips going first now here, full accumulators, foundation, logistic drones, and logistic vessels. And each, each station is bringing in space warpers. So that way, 
whenever I'm out and about in the universe, I can just tap into this, request the basic stuff, and it'll come to me instead of flying back and forth. And as I go along, if I need some other stuff, I will uh, set it up here and set up another station. Ooh, I know, it was a real quick update, but that is what has been happening in between episodes. Now, this guy, I wanna be near, I picked out a spot earlier. It's by the, uh, what was it, by the prisms that I was gonna set up uh, the Casimir crystals. And I know it's around here, so, oh, did I go the wrong way? Yeah, oh well, there they are, boop, right here, boom. And the other thing, when I was changing, uh, where was it? There was a recipe that took the prisms. Damn it, which one was it? It was, uh, uh, prisms were used in, oh yeah, the photon combiners. This old recipe took prisms and circuit boards. So when I cleared out the machines, um, I got stuck with a, a few prisms. So they're all right here. And this little storage unit gonna be pumped into there and they're gonna get used up. No wasting materials. Okay, Casimir crystals, alternate, the advanced recipe. There we go. So we need three items coming in and one going out. And the goal on these Casimir crystals is we're gonna go after 900 per minute. So it's gonna take 60 assembly machines. So first off, let's get, oh, I can't get in, how tight can I get it there? Uh, uh, let's go right there, boom. And that one should be charging this right here. Okay, and since this one's gonna be a little bit on the busy side, let's give him, um, 10 drones there we go so casimir crystals we need optical grading crystals uh, there they are boom and we'll keep it at about like 2000 now at 2000 let's see how many are we going to burn through a minute um bum, bum, bum. uh looks like Oh my gosh, 5,400 a minute? Dang. Ooh, that's ambitious. Okay, let's crank it up to 5,000. Then we will also need graphene and hydrogen. So graphene and hydrogen, boom. Um, and I'm also not going to set this to demand until I get everything set up in case I've got to move this thing. Oh my gosh, what a pain in the ass that was before. And I'm hoping I can get 30 machines going right along here. That's, I think we can do it. Yeah, 30 on each side. We'll, we'll find out here in a moment. Okay, so let's get these bad boys going. So if we've got a belt uh, going from here... To there so we'll have that coming in and we'll start this guy right there now we've got three items coming in and we'll send out the crystals that direction and we're going to use the alternate recipe oh, for components boom right there there it is. Okay, now for the sorters, we'll have one going in and one coming out. Then we'll have that in and that in. Now I'm hoping, let's see, one, two, three, boom, we'll set up another belt right there and another belt right there. And just boom and get this recipe set okay now okay so it's gonna go out on that belt so we need to set this sorter from here to there then we need this item over to there okay 
Yeah, because this middle sorter is bringing it from here out onto that belt, which this is going to be the outbound for the Casimir crystals all in one belt. And then we'll take you to there and you to there. Okay. Now the idea is coming out of this station, boom, two items in that side. And coming out of here, two items on that side. Now let's go ahead and get this set up. All right, that should have done it right then and there. Let's uh, go ahead and fire this thing up and see if we can get 900 per minute out of it. All right, so, boy oh boy. Um, yeah, there we go, graphene. You know what, I, I wanna take this down to like 4,000. Hydrogen, we got lots of it, so we'll demand all of it. Holy cow. Okay, let's drop another 10 more in there. And there comes some stuff right. Well, let's try this. Oh, that was 10. Boom. Okay. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay. All three components are going along. And there it goes. It's starting to crank them out. Just want to double check, make sure everything's bopping up and down. Yep. Walk down the line. I learned the hard way. Double check. Don't be in the rush. Make sure everything's working and then move on to the next one. Because then you have to come back and figure out why and where the bottleneck is. Okay. Yeah. I'm, I'm getting so anxious to get to the Dyson Sphere just to start sending the rockets up there. See, like this one. What's going on with this guy? There it goes. Okay, it looks like these guys are short on material also. Okay, slowly but surely they're getting there. Yep, on the optical grading crystals. Well, dang. You guys need more more ships? Yeah, okay. Let's, uh, there, we'll put, we'll put 50 in it. We'll get this thing going. Now... Let's just, oh man, only halfway down there. Okay. Let's see, what do we got? Yes. We're starting to get in there. Slowly but surely, production's getting up. Oh my gosh, did I? I hope I didn't screw this up. Oh man. Where's my handy dandy calculator? I'm going to do some math here. Okay, this. 
guy. Let's see. 15 minute or 15 second cycle crafting time. It takes six. Uh, let's see, 15, 60, 75 per minute. Holy crap. So 1,800 divided by 75 equals 24. Damn. I got six more assemblers than uh, what one belt of crystals can handle. Oh. And it's that throughput. Where is it? Right there of these guys of the optical grading crystals. It's trying to shove them out there as fast as possible. Yeah, see, like, it's just gushing them out. Okay, all right. Oops, I didn't do the math on that part. Okay, got a little bit close and... Wow. Yeah. Oh, and the hydrogen. Oh, geez, the hydrogen. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh crap. Okay. So if we're using this other one. Yeah. Four second, 15. Oh my god. This is even going to be worse. Yeah, because it's taking even more so. Okay. So on th this guy, four second crafting time. Damn, that's 15 per minute. 15 times 12. Is 180. Oh, son of a. Okay. So that means I can only have. The hydrogen coming in can support 10 on each side. Ah. Oh. So that's only 20 total. Oh. Completely 10 over. Where's all my hydrogen? Yeah. Okay. Let's see if we can find this bottleneck for the hydrogen. Where are you guys. Where are you grabbing the hydrogen from? There, okay, we'll go follow this and see where these guys are coming from. And maybe drop in some extra um, drones. Bring the stuff over. Uh oh. Where the hell am I bringing the hydrogen in from? No, no. Oh, there we go. There were some of them. Where are you guys coming in from? Is it right here? The deuterium? No. no. All right. Which station's bringing the stuff in? Oh, can I just pass it? There's hydrogen going out right there. This one? Oh my gosh, yeah. Why aren't you bringing in more? We're tapping into that gas giant. Not even using all of them. Oh, warpers might help too, huh? No. No, because the grass giant is just right there. A Lula Borealis. Two. Where's our gas giant? That's ah, somewhere out there. Yep, that's what it is. It's that hydrogen. Okay, there goes the second ship. Okay, that's our bottleneck right now is that hydrogen. And But we've also got... This, let's see, this is the fractionators. This is coming in. So why aren't you, oh, because it's demanding the hydrogen and that's the supply, damn. Okay. So hydrogen right now is the bottleneck. Hmm, I'm thinking about throwing down a second one of these guys, but why aren't more ships going up to get it off of Alula Borealis. Number two. Huh, interesting. Oh my gosh, that's why. How about we do that? Crank it up to 10,000. There they go. Oh, look at that. Oh, and they just went right around the circle. Okay. There it is. Okay, that should see a significant improvement in it. Yeah, look at that, 5720 coming in. All 10 of them went out. Yeah. Look at that. Come on back in, hit the dock. Boom. There we go. 
That was a quick trip. Thank you. Boom, boom. Light, unload, and take off again. Wash, rinse, and repeat. Bring in that hydrogen. Oh, look at Nice choreography. Yeah, there it goes. Yeah, now it's sucking all those guys up. Okay. Found the bottleneck. So this should be doing a little bit better with the hydrogen now. It's trying. Oh my gosh, it's trying. It's slowly building up. Yep. Okay. Because it can't suck it out fast enough. I got two lines, 1800 per minute. And we're definitely bringing in more than we need. Yeah, or, or not. Oh. Yeah, we got 50 here and 50 on the other side doing their thing. Damn. Uh, okay, it's a semi-success. Yeah. Okay, so so it's a, uh, what do we got? 10, 20, 20 machines. So I'm going to have to make the adjustment on that. So if we've got 20 of these guys making it. Oh my God, that's only 300 per minute. Is that right? Yeah, 300 per minute. Okay. Boom. I will call that at 300 per minute. Any, yeah, damn. Or if I set up another station, no, 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 because it's still the belt is the limiting factor. Damn. I was thinking of setting up another another planetary tower. Boom. It's yeah. It's just not able to push it through fast enough. Holy crap. Okay, I'll learn on the next build. But yeah, we'll, I'll go ahead and call this 300 per minute. That's a little bit over ambitious, but let's double check here. Okay. 15 second crafting time, and it takes 12 hydrogen. And so there's 15, 15 times 12. Yep, 15 times 12 is 180. And 180 can only handle 10 of them. And 10 on each side is a total of 20. Of 20 machines. Damn. Okay. So let's do this. Oop, not. How about. Let's go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. This can be 20 machines on each side. So let's cut you there, there. And we'll cut you there, there, and there. Okay. Hmm. I wonder if I could set up a second one. I really wanted 900 per minute just to do it. 300 per minute's a good. You know what? I. Oh man, gosh, I haven't even checked the recording time on this one. Yeah, yeah, with the... Uh, we're at about actually 30 minutes of gameplay right now and reduced with the quickness of the build. Yeah. Let's call it an episode right there. I'm going to fix this up and probably set up a second and a third line here with this kind of a setup. Probably go drop another planetary station and uh, yeah. So... What I'll do is I'll do that right now, and I'll see everybody in two seconds. There it is. 900. Casimir crystals. Is it, am I calling it the right thing? Yeah, Casimir crystals. Per minute. 900 of them per minute. Uh, yeah, I kind of left that one there. Had it fade into this one station here. Here, they filled up really fast. I like it. I like it. Then, yeah, I went with the idea. Oh, what am I doing walking? How about we do this? Boop. Yeah. Uh, set up 10 more. Um, logistics vessels to go pick up hydrogen and then also the optical grading crystals and remote demanded both of those and local demand on the warpers. So 
those guys are taken care of. And then what I did is I just took the hydrogen that was here and plumbed it whoop, boom into that station. And then this line is going right into that station there. So, oh, auto save. Okay. Yeah. Not symmetrical. Well, two of them, two thirds of them are symmetrical. The other one, I was not going to move it. Uh, but yeah, so there it is. Oh my gosh, yes. Casimir crystals, 900. Ooh, ooh, there it is. There it is. That's the one. Casimir crystals, 900 per minute. Okay. Next episode, we're going to be working towards, let's see, Casimir crystals. Oh, yep, that's it. The plane filter. Need the plane filter. Titanium glass and Casimir crystals. So, titanium glass. That's what we're going off. Dirt right there. Water. Titanium ingots and glass. Okay, which uh, we're making all three of those. So that's going to be a quick build. So uh, we'll see what happens in the next episode. But thank you for joining me on this journey in Dyson Sphere program. And as always, enjoy life and be safe. And drink the dew.